Hello, everybody. What's up? My name is RapidCat45 here, and today, but -da -da -da. um, I'm gonna be doing um a review on this, the Nintendo Switch. This thing, <clears throat> you know, I've played it, or I've had mine for about two weeks now, and honestly, right now, it's I I'm really loving it. Um, you know, it's just, it's a great system, and, um, yeah, so, anyways, and then I'll give, uh, my thoughts, uh, if I remember, this is the key, if I remember, I'll give you my thoughts of if you should buy it right now or not, uh, you know, or wait, or, if you, yeah, so, anyways, let me kind of adjust this a bit, there you go. All right, so let's go ahead and turn it on. So when you turn it on, it just kind of gives you this little screen. Uh, as you can see, it says press A to continue, or uh, it says home menu, uh, or pl uh, plus or minus to do the news. And uh, ooh, apparently I'm going to hit the stand, which I'm going to do the first time. So let me go ahead and take the... Uh, the, what are these joy cons? That's what they're. I'm gonna take the joy cons off here and kind of bring the screen up closer so you guys can see. So, as you can see here, it's uh, you know. So let me press a uh, plus or minus. As you can see, it's just kind of a thing. Uh, I guess I can't go back. Oh, okay. Oh, now we're into the news. Um, yeah, I don't want to be in the news. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. There we go. All right, so. So if you press A, you press it three times. Oh, okay, I guess it's in there. And then it'll bring you to the home menu. Uh, I think you can turn that off if you don't really appreciate that. It doesn't really bring a safety to it. It kind of... Well, okay, I guess this Joy-Con is not connected. There we go. That was weird. Um, yeah, so I guess it's just a safety for, like, uh, kids... Um, you know, if like a little kid gets into it, they're probably not going to press the same button three times. And if they do, then, well, yeah, I guess you should have been prepared or something. I don't know. Um, but anyways, yeah, this is the home menu. Uh, not much going on. Uh, basically, you can play the games, you know, which right now I have Breath of the Wild going. I don't know where I am because I let my cousin play for a little bit. Oh, okay, I know where I am. All right, so... Yeah, probably should eat something, but, you know, we're not going to. Um, <laughs> yeah, so, you know, there's the games and stuff. As you can see, there's quite a few slots for, you know, your needs or whatever. I don't entirely know. Uh, whatever you need to do. Uh, but, yeah, so, uh, let's go ahead and go. So, news is essentially what you think it is. It's just, hey, look, stuff you may not have known. Like, for instance... If you're having a great time, don't leave the 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 uh, kickstand out while you dock it, cause uh, you're gonna snap that boy right off. Well, actually, I think I believe it snaps right back in. I guess they, Nintendo kind of prepared for that. Uh, Nintendo eShop is just the eShop. I've not I've never actually been into it because I haven't linked my Nintendo account to the my Nintendo Switch yet because I haven't. Um, album, you can just take screenshots, which right now I believe I just have some, yeah, I just have screenshots of, like, yeah, I think these are, yeah, I think this is the, uh, okay, these two are from the first day I played, and this is from the second day I played. Those are the only screenshots I've taken so far. But if you ever do want to take a screenshot, this little button down here on your Joy-Con, just press that, it'll take a screenshot. It'll also knock down your switch, so be careful about that. Um, no, but, uh, actually, what we're gonna wanna do is kickstand this back up so that I don't knock it over again, maybe. Um, and then controllers here. And controllers, what I believe this does is, yeah, you can change the order of your Joy-Con. So, like, if you have another pair, like, let's say you have, you know, the black pair and then, like, a pair of blue ones, or ne the neon blue ones, you can make it so, like, hey, my left one is going to be the black one and my right one's going to be the blue one instead of being black and black and blue and blue. Um, and then you can just 
um, you can just pair new controllers. Um, yeah, and the Switch also knows like when the controllers are in the system and when they're not. Like as you can see, uh, see how they're down here on their own. Um, if we put them onto here, shwink. Now they've added, it's been put onto the system, and it shows you the battery life for all of the things, so. Blink. There you go, as you can see, now they're back separate. This one here means that they are the first pair, as you can see, they're also the first LED on, out of the four LEDs on the Joy-Cons, too, so let you know that this is the first pair and well for me the only pair so change order and grip uh yeah you can just kind of do you know i don't know what's happening okay we're just gonna go back and uh controller not connect no whoa hold up no don't want okay well there there's my first pair and my only pair um yeah so that's kind of system settings uh Pretty much straightforward, you know. There's some system settings. Yeah, lock uh, console and sleep mode so like you can turn that off so it doesn't do that, which doesn't make sense to me. Uh, the the uh, parent control, which you can also do on your smartphone, which I'll probably do later or show you guys. Um, system memory. Uh, this is kind of your memory. Micro SD card, which I have not put in yet. There's my profile. You can edit if you want, you know. Here's, oh, yeah, themes. Those are back, apparently. I don't know how you get more, but, you know, you got your basic white or your basic black, depending. Um, normally, I like black backgrounds, but on the Switch, I kind of like the normal white one. I don't know why. Yeah, and then there's, you know, there's all your goods. Uh, and then sleep mode. Uh, basically, it just... It's like you just press the power button. I'm, I'm guessing, yeah, and press the power button again, I think this is just like, you just press, yeah, it's just like you turned it off, really, that's all that really happened, oh, well, it wasn't that fun, um, okay, is this Joy-Con, I don't know, that's weird, oh, that's right, I think the left Joy-Con's the one that has the weird, uh, problems, uh, and then in the top, you got, uh, 9.26pm, you got your Wi-Fi, and your battery percent, if you ever want to check your battery, uh, just hit uh, LZ and LR at the same time. Look, it's at 99%. Cool. Um, then you can go to, you know, your profile, and then you can change your profile picture, which actually has quite a few. It's actually really cool. I mean, look. I mean, look at all of these. Look at all of these ones you can choose. Yeah, you got... Actually, you have uh, some Breath of the Wild ones. You know? You got some Animal Crossing, Splatoon... Um, Metroid, you know, you got, or you can just make it your me, you know, all that good stuff, you know, you get Link, shooting or some Zelda, or a Guardian, you know, so, so people, I don't know, you know, there's just stuff, and then you can change the background color, and there's, there's a lot of colors, so, you know, you, you do what you want, Oh, okay, stuff's happening. Uh, then you got, you know, friends list. I don't know. I don't have any friends that have a Switch yet. I'm assuming that'll happen later. Uh, you also need a Nintendo account, so... Or my Nintendo account linked. And that's another reason why I don't have that done yet. Actually, no, I lied. I do have a friend that has a Switch. Hmm. I've been lying to you guys. Uh, yeah, that's kind of it for inside. Unless you're going to play a game, obviously. Then, you know, there's, like, more stuff to do. But if you're not playing a game, then you're kind of just stuck, uh, you know, with this home and, uh, this home screen. Uh, so, that's kind of the outside. So, let's go ahead and take a look at the Nintendo Switch itself, and then the Joy-Cons we'll take a look at in a minute. So, the Nintendo Switch itself, it's kind of just this little tablet thing. Yes, it has fingerprints. My cousin thought it was funny to get my his fingerprints all over my switch yeah i wasn't quite thrilled when that originally happened but now i'm like yeah whatever they're just fingerprints i can wipe them off with something later um yeah so anyways doesn't weigh much 
Um, for what it is, it's you know it's obviously got a little bit of heft, but it's not. It's honestly not that heavy. Um, so the bottom, we just kind of have your USB Type C, which it is indeed the USB Type C port. Motorcycles, so apparently too. Uh, you have your oh, what do you your that one thing? I don't know. The three DS had them too. Serial code or whatever. I don't remember something. You know, so if you call Nintendo and they're like, oh, what's your thing? And then you're like, read it off. Or if it's worn off on your 3DS, you actually have to, like, break into your 3DS. Mmm, good times. Unless you got the new Nintendo 3DS. But only the new Nintendo 3DS. Even the XL, it won't happen. See, look, because, like, this is, like, the only one where you just have to, like, oh, no, look, there's my code. Cool. The end. All the other ones, like, like, um, here, let me show you. It's like, yeah, it's on the bottom, but if it if that wears off, which it will, depending on how you put your hands, I always put my hands on it so, like, it won't, but it'll wear off, and then you have to break into your system. It's not, I don't, I never had to do that personally, but I'm assuming it's not exactly fun. Oh, yeah, by the way, this does have a touch screen, so you probably will get fingerprints on it, because it's not a, it's a legit uh, touch screen this time, actually, so, like, your smartphones and stuff. It's one of those touchscreens, unlike the 3DS, which had that weird one. And the Wii U, too. Like, that was, I don't know. I mean, I for those systems, honestly, I felt like it was fine, but I guess the Switch, I kind of wish the Switch had that. Or, like, it was like a multi, like a multi-screen, like, where you could use a stylus or your finger. Ew. That's kind of really what I was hoping for. But, no. We just get touchscreen, which means fingerprints. Um, and then there's a kind of rail to uh, put the Joy-Cons on so you can charge them because the joy cons just charge while they're in the stock or if you have the special charging grip then it'll charge that way too okay focus maybe yeah, i don't know it was and then it wasn't um it's i don't know i'm sorry i can't like focus this in a beautiful way all right good enough um so here you got your game card slot which the games are really small um headphone port or Headphone jack. Hey, look. It has one. <coughs> Apple. Um, anyways. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> this little vent for cooling, because the switch does get quite hot. Hot. Um, got your power button and your volume. Doodads. Yep. Um, and then on the back, you just kind of got the Nintendo Switch logo, some more heat things, because, again, it gets pretty hot. I don't know. For me, I've never made it. It's never gone, like, super hot, but apparently it can get, like, really hot. Then you got your kickstand, and underneath your kickstand is where the micro SD card would go, which is nice because, you know, you don't have to, like, break into the bottom of the system to install it. Uh, 3DS? No, I'm just kidding. Well, no, I'm not kidding. You actually did. On, well, on the new Nintendo 3DS and the new Nintendo 3DS. So, you had to break to the bottom to change it, but at least it was pre-installed with one. However, then again, you, like what? It, some people are only going to go in there once. Some people won't even go in there once. So, like, it didn't really matter. I don't know why people made such a big deal about it, but, you know, whatever. I'm not the... Apparently, I don't count as major. Apparently. Um, I don't know what I was going with there, but... I don't know why people got so frustrated. I'm like, what? You're going to change it, like, once in the time you own the thing. Why does it really matter that much? You know, if that, some people are fine with the standard what four it gives you yeah i think it gives you four like some people are going to be completely fine with that like i was i lived my most of my life on or my 3ds life on a four gigabyte sd card and then i got a bunch of 3ds's and then memory didn't really matter that much um anyways here are the joy cons they're relatively small which is good because they actually kind of feel uh, nice um but yeah anyways so Got your home button on this one, and as you can see, it turned on the switch. You also have your screenshot button, which it didn't take a screenshot of the home menu, so that's good. Um, then you got your uh, D-pad, which isn't a D-pad because it's not a D-pad. Because if you uh, if you're playing one of those multiplayer games, these act as your A, B, X, and Y buttons, because you know. It's kind of important, or I guess you hold this one like this, so that you have that. Um, you know, there's a thumbstick. 
here's another one there's some a b x y buttons there's your plus there's your minus and then again if you're holding it like this these are kind of not exactly convenient to hit so they give you uh, some more over here uh, which these are s l and s r which are their own buttons it appears they're not like these i thought it was gonna be like two triggers or something no but yeah those act as your um shoulder buttons i don't know because there's not really any triggers then i don't know and then again same thing for this one which this one is slightly less comfortable yeah i kind of like this one better i'm not gonna lie to you this one this one's all right i mean you know it's like again it's nice that you can use the two controllers or well the technically one controller is two control okay you know what you get the point it does good that's what it does Anyways, yes, so that's kind of the Nintendo Switch for you, um, battery life, depending on what you're doing, will last from three to five hours, um, and of course, unless you're docked, in which then it'll be charging it, and then you don't really have to worry about that, uh, Joy-Cons, I don't know what the battery life in them is, it's definitely longer than the Switch, that's, but that's the only thing I do know, um, I believe the Switch can have up, yeah, well, that would make sense, uh, four, up to four pairs of Joy-Cons or, like, just remotes in general connected to it at once. So you can have four pairs of Joy-Cons or, like, two pairs of Joy-Cons and then two uh, Pro Controllers, you know, whatever you have. It'll do four, and if you have, like, five and you want to swap one out, like, hey, let's say I want Joy all Joy-Cons instead of three Joy-Cons and a Pro Controller, you can do that. Um... Of course, another thing about it is because the Joy-Cons slide off, you know, you can have these cool accessory doodads that do the accessory thing, and then look, now it's a controller. Not a super comfortable one, but it's a controller. Uh, and then, of course, there's ones of the charging variety, which look exactly like this, except for charge the Joy-Cons. Um, and, I mean, yeah, you know, it's... What more do you want from it, really? You know, look, now it's a thing. Um, yeah. So, anyways, my opinion, if, uh, since I did remember, if, should you buy it now? Or should you wait? Um, well, really, the only, I don't know. This kind of really just depends to you. Because, while the Nintendo Switch is really nice and fun, if, you, if you're if you kind of on the line of should I just stick with my Wii U and 3DS and not move over to the Switch yet, uh, you probably don't want to move over to it yet uh, for this reason um, alone. Because if there's not very many games for it, and if you're just in it for Breath of the Wild... Um, if you're just in it for Breath of the Wild. Breath of the Wild is on the Nintendo or is on the Wii U, which so because it was originally made for the Wii U, anyways. Well, it was going to be made, and then well, was, but the, it's like you know that if that's the only game you're going for, which is Breath of the Wild, then you probably just want to stick with your Wii U. Uh, if you don't really care about that. And you want like um, what are some more games? Snipper clips and uh, some other game. I think Just Dance 2017's on this, and uh, or um, One Two Switch. You know, that's it's like it's on. You know, if you want those games, then you can switch over to the Switch. Uh, no pun intended. Uh, or maybe it was. I didn't plan on it. Uh, excuse me, but um, yeah, I don't. So, it's really just up to your call. It's not... There's not enough games on it that I... If you're on the line, I wouldn't say you'd want to buy it quite yet. I'd say you want to wait. Actually, no, I take that back. And for this reason, if you can find the Switch, take it. If it's at regular price, like in stores, like I found it, I'm like, I ain't paying like 400 to 500 bucks for a Nintendo Switch. I'm waiting until I can find one. And I'm so glad I could find one. But if you can't, like, I think that's the problem. So if you can find one, uh, then you can snag it. But if you don't really want the Nintendo Switch, or, like, if you're on the line, um, 
and you can and you want to wait like a few like a year or two uh then it'll be fine because then you can find the switches a lot easier but apparently it's going to be kind of hard to find the switch for like the rest of the year um you know i'm so i th yeah it's just it's what it is but if you can find one, I guess grab one if you have money, and I don't know. If you're just in it for Breath of the Wild, uh, I'd wait and just buy it for the Wii U. If you don't have a Wii U and want it for Breath of the Wild, then I think you should probably just buy it. Well, you should just buy it. Well, no, because the Wii U's would be cheaper, wouldn't they? I don't know. It's your call, man. You, you know what? You do you. And I'll do me. And we're not going to worry about it. Yeah, I think that sums up the video. I got nothing else.